Come thrift with me. How many stores am I going to shop this morning? So I'm working on a bedroom makeover. Today I'm shopping around for some last minute items put into the makeover. I'll be looking at some furniture and home decor. I love going to the Goodwill bins. I never know what I'll find. And I need end tables to put beside the bed. And these look more like little side tables, like coffee tables, but for $8. And they seem to be French provincial. They're definitely going to go home with me, but how, how? So I call my husband, who has a truck, because I cannot fit those in a Challenger. Let's go to this thrift store over here. It is the Glenmore Thrift Store. We have not done a tour together in there yet. This is a smaller thrift store, but I found some really nice lamps in here before. And they have like a lot of home decor, smaller stuff, smaller stuff. Okay, let's head right over to the back. Cause I'm just looking for some accents for my bedroom. Oh my, look at that. That's really nice. Yeah, they have really nice lamps. That's some nice art too. Okay, that's not a painting. More like a canvas with a print on it. Really, really nice stuff. Oh my, look at that. That's vintage. Yeah, that's a nice painting. Yeah. I don't see a price on it, but it's not quite what I'm looking for for my bedroom. Still. Oh, oh, that's nice. Look at that. It's a print, a print for twelve dollars. Oh, look at that lamp too. Okay. And tons of, tons of toys. Let's have a look over here. Yeah, that's some nice stuff. Okay, I'm not seeing anything really that stands out for what I want to do. But it's good just to take a quick tour, right? Because you never know what you're going to find. I like that. $3. That's pretty. Well, while I'm here, I might as well go into the front and see what they have for jewelry. Nice little jewelry box. Those are old. Three dollars. Japan. Nice jewelry. Oh my. $22 for the set. It's a good deal. Look at that. That's nice. Oh, that's really pretty. $25 for this whole set. Look at that. Oh my. $25. Wow. Tons of bowls. Alright guys, I think we're going to head over to the next thrift store. And what is this? Thrift store number three for the day? Wins. One of my favorites. One of my all-time favorites. Oh, that's nice. $30. It's really, really cute. It's really quiet in here today. It's early. And some nice lamps too. So we'll head over to the art section. I still have some room on my walls to add some more art. Oh, well that's sweet. It's really cute. 
Okay, let's go check out the latest stuff that they put out right here. So that has a, a chip in it right yeah. here. I would have taken it for twelve dollars if it wasn't chipped. This one. Here. Two of them together, right? Yeah, the one is it's got the sign. Uh huh. You guys looking another me? Ducks Unlimited. People collect that. Okay, that's like a mid-century modern style horse. Check it out. That's stunning. Because the live one, the real one needs a five grand. It's ten dollars. Like this guy? Yeah, it's a ten dollars. a cat just like that at home. The real one though. Because it's going to be outside, right? So, yeah. So, we'll get all wrapped. Yeah. Outside. Yeah. Beautiful. Yeah, thank you. I'm still open for another layout for my bedroom. <laughs> So quiet in here all of a sudden. Kind of creepy. <laughs> So about to head into the Goodwill over here in Sunridge area and I found some blue crystal marbles at Wins. Not bad, $3 a bag. It's slim pickings. There's a lot of people out shopping, but I'm not feeling the, I don't know, the, the shelves have stuff on it, but I kind of picked over. Just one of those days. Okay, there's a few more thrift stores to hit, so let's run into Goodwill. Everything green tag, 50% off. I was here four days ago. There were a lot of treasures, a lot. So I know what I'm looking for. Basically stuff to go into my bedroom. I still haven't found enough wall art for my bedroom makeover. And I'm getting more and more flexible <laughs> as time goes by. See what I mean? Everything's kind of scun out. Not much. I really like this print. Got a really nice watercolor here too.
God, I'm just not finding what I need. I'm finding everything else. Oh, my gosh, that looks old. It's kind of neat. What would I use it for? I'm not sure. It's actually really cute, though. For $2.50? Good price. Okay. Alright, guys. Oh. Well, that's beautiful. Is that modern? That's Murano. Can you see that? Anyway, that's Murano Blast for $15. Wow. And just a side note here, I never see a collection this big. So you have the bowl with like the silver base, but look at all of the dessert dishes that go along with it. I never see that. I might see the odd one like this, or a lone bowl, but never, never a big bunch like that. This is obviously vintage. Check it out, 250. Look at the feet, the pedestal. Kind of like little little dessert glasses, I guess. Christmas is coming. Those are nice. Okay, guys. Let's go hit another store. I have some at home. I got them at another thrift store. I think I paid 50 cents. I got two. Those are nice. Those are really nice. Head over to the front. And then we'll head closer into Calgary. Well, we are into Calgary right now. But we'll go right into Sunridge area. Vintage. $10. Is that sweet? They do have some nice art in the front, but not quite what I want. Jewelry boxes. Okay. That's really nice too. Alright, let's move on. I need to come up with a better plan here, because I really need to find some stuff. I want to get this video done. My bedroom makeover video, that is. So let's... I'm going to just stop in here at McDonald's and uh, grab a decaf, think, because there's quite a few other thrift stores around, but which one would have what I want, what I need? Hey, it's a dilemma. Maybe my luck will change with a little donut and a decaf. So up next is the Veterans Thrift Store. Um, it's hit or miss here. Never know what I'll find, but I have found some pretty interesting stuff here. So let's go on in. Some pretty neat stuff. Here are those bottles that I did a short of the other day. The nicer collections are here in the front. And, oh, look at that. Isn't that nice? <laughs> oh, that's sweet. Oh, that's so cute. $60. Nice. No, oh, their M&M's collection is sold. They had more the other day when I was in. And this is the other half of the store. Sixty dollars. They have a ton of lamps. Tons of lamps. They're all six dollars unless otherwise marked.
And they have a bit of artwork too. Really have to do some digging. A lot of prints. I like that. It's hard to. Oh, God, I was going to tip everything over. Finger. That's really nice, actually. Hmm. It's a print, like on canvas, just a, a canvas, I should say. Great, no price tag, all that work, no price tag. All right. Oh, that's old. That's old and in a new frame. All right, let's head out into glassware. So they're having a ten dollar uh, fill a bag Christmas items. So fill a paper bag like that. Ten dollars. And this is included too. Ten dollars. So much. I think that's the cheapest I've ever found Christmas decorations. It's ten dollars for a bag full. Yeah, I was wondering about this. If that's vintage. It's thirty-five dollars. Some pretty neat stuff here. I have tons of stuff. Wow. I kind of like this clock. I've never seen anything like it before. I wonder if it was something else and then somebody added the face to it. I'm just having bad luck finding what I need. <laughs> Usually I walk to a thrift store, I find tons of stuff that I want. Tons. But today, today's a challenge. So we're gonna hit a lot of thrift stores today. Bell collection, $10 for all those bells. $10. Oh, some decoys. Nice fabric for five dollars. Oh, excuse me. All right, guys. Where to next? I'm not seeing anything that I really need in the Christmas section, otherwise I'd fill a bag for the $10. Okay, let's head to the next thrift store. MCC Thrift Shop. Everything with the blue tag, 75% off. Great, let's hit the furniture. It's rare to see two sets of like, I'm going to call this one French Provincial and this one, I don't know, the same thing. It's rare to see two sets in the same store. So 
Nice mirror. It's really cute. Lots of tables. Kind of art deco, maybe. Oh my, look at that. It's like a divider. You go behind that and change your clothes. $500. Oh gosh, no wonder. That's beautiful. I'll just step back here so you can really get a good look at that. $500. Look at, it's not inlay. Gosh, look at that. That's really beautiful. Wow. Well, that's a gorgeous sideboard. $550. Beautiful. Okay. Oh, look at that. It's nice. Like marquetry. Very nice. Well, we could check out over here. Beautiful, colorful glass. See, things with a blue tag, like they said at the front, 75% off, so that would be like 25 cents. Not bad. Okay, they have some bigger stuff over here. Not quite what I'm looking for, but that's really cute. That's really cute. That's exactly my bedroom's color tones right there. Exactly. Okay, this is the cutest hedgehog I've ever seen in my life. Check him out. Is that adorable? With pine cones on his back. Okay, put you back in there, little fella. I have never seen this before. So, they're saying it's a, a Lewis Comfort Tiffany dragonfly vase. Look how skinny it is. So according to them, <laughs> you add water to it. And then you can collapse it after. Can you believe that? That's so neat. Three dollars. Nice. So this is a gorgeous vase for sixty-five dollars. Move it over here so you can see it. It's beautiful. England. Oh, the radio. Fifty dollars. <laughs> That's cute. That's really nice. Thank you. And it works for twenty five dollars. No wondering. Hmm. Well, that's a maybe. I'm kind of neat to have an old radio in my bedroom. That's a really nice scarf. Three dollars. It's very pretty. Yay, doilies. I might be able to work these into my decor. Okay, okay, I'll pick through these. 25 cents each. Okay, let's look. All right, guys, Value Village. I wanted to donate some stuff today, but they got it all blocked off with tape. I guess something went down here. Okay. All right, guys, will I be lucky here? You know, the big stuff that I found for my bedroom was easy to find, but the little stuff, the little stuff is going to be the death of me. But you know what? I always find stuff here. Always. I always find stuff at Value Village. Mm 
massive store. So I was in the other day and I saw a tree. Probably should have grabbed it when I saw it. There it is. That one's nice too. Actually, that one's nicer. Okay, so they have trays like you put them on your bed, you know, for like breakfast in bed. So I'll be walking out of here with one of these trays. I'm gonna look around and we'll continue. I'll come back to you on it. Christmas, more Christmas stuff and it's literally back to school. Okay, this tree is speaking to me. This is a maybe for a crafting project. Well, when it rains, it pours. Um, I'm thinking about using this set in the, in the bedroom makeover. Okay, so four pieces for $6, pure one. And then there's this set here. Okay, this is vintage. What do we have? Fire King. Vintage Fire King. So that's a maybe. I want two two cups and two little saucers. Have something in mind. Oh my, they have old country roses right out here in the wild. Usually this is under lock and key in the front. Wow. So six pieces, $20. Five for fifteen dollars. What do we got here? Four pieces for twenty. Five pieces for twenty-five. And they say four pieces for thirty. Then you get into the coffee cups and the teacups. Eight dollars and ten dollars. Why? A little farther down, we have sweet violets. Sweet violets. So ten dollars for that pair. And we have some little plates for eight dollars for two. That's not bad. I'm shocked to see that out here. You just never know what you're gonna find. Oh, this has mid-century modern written all over it, eh? So you get the three for four dollars. It's just so much stuff here. I'm feeling a bit better now, and. I was starting to worry. It's harder to find little stuff than it is to find big stuff, I find, when I'm really looking for something specific. The end caps are bare. Oh, wow. Okay. A lot of artwork, but nothing really catching my eye. So I didn't find a pair of white doilies at MCC thrift store. I left there empty handed, so still looking, still looking. Those are nice. this out. Beaded turkey. A beaded turkey. It's like a table runner. Gorgeous. Okay guys, so here's my thrift haul. And I might have found a treasure here. I think I have Lucite, Lucite folding chairs from 1970. So I'm going to pay, 50, uh, actually I'm going to pay $12 for the pair. No, oh, that's kind of exciting. Plus I have marbles, Christmas tree for a future project. And then for my bedroom, I got that tray, teapot, and little cup and saucers. So pretty big haul. And I'm picking up a necklace. It's going to be brought to me at the cash. They, yeah, I'll show you the necklace in the big bedroom reveal because it's going to be, it's going to be part of the video actually I'm gonna work it into my decor yeah a necklace okay guys hit that subscribe and I'll catch you in my next video bye